The only reason I believe that Mitch McConnell feels completely fine and gung-ho about going forward with this scenario right now is because it worked for him in 2016 and he paid no political price. So God forbid Joe Biden gets elected and Stephen Breyer dies and Mitch McConnell still has the Senate majority, he'll pull off the same heist all over again because it's now worked twice. Yeah. Unless we do something to change the calculus, yeah. we can't expect Mitch McConnell to change his behavior. It would be irrational for him to change his behavior because he's winning. For the sake of you know, trying to get everybody to de-escalate, you need to stand up to the bully at some point. When all these things start playing out, if the Affordable Care Act is struck down, if right. a Joe Biden administration signs into law a background checks bill and then a 6-3 court strikes it down, if a Joe Biden administration signs into law the John Lewis Voting Rights Restoration Act and then a 6-3 court strikes it down, I think that the Supreme Court will become a political villain and there will be a desire to add seats, not because 11 seats yeah. versus nine is the way it should be, or 13 seats, but because people will say, this is anti-democratic. 